Hello everyone I hope you all are fine at your home So today we are going to start a second chapter of class 8 that is window movie maker Now what is window movie maker Windows movie maker is a video editing software for windows based computers Earlier it is used to be a part of windows XP Now in windows 7 it can be downloaded for free as a part of windows live essentials that includes mail messenger photo gallery movie maker writer family safety and other web based services such as onedrive and outlook.com with windows movie maker you can create movies from your photos and videos whether they are already on your computer or still in your camera this software lets you create movies by using special effects transitions and themes to you to make your movies stand out You can make movies on various occasions like birthday parties and family gatherings by using Movie Maker. In just a few clicks you can share your movies on social networking sites such as Facebook and YouTube or upload them to OneDrive. Now let's discuss about the features of the Windows Movie Maker. The first feature is auto save. Projects are automatically saved after a fixed interval of time. so that the data does not get lost in case of the power failure or unexpected application closure second audio from a video audio tracks can be extracted from the video files as we can done in the many apps like viva video and in shorts third download music from the online libraries window movie maker allows you to directly download audio files from online stores such as audio micro and vimeo music store fourth outline on text outline can be added on the text elements to improve visibility and appeal you can also modify the outline color and size as per your requirement as you can do in the word document in the microsoft word fifth proxy video Movie Maker uses a lower resolution video for previewing the purposes so that the software runs smoothly on any computer. And last, audio waveforms. Audio can be represented as waveforms in Window Movie Maker. This helps to locate the audio files easily in a project. Now, how we can start the Windows Movie Maker in our laptop or computer? To open the Window Movie Maker, follow these steps. click on the start button then all programs and then select the movie maker option and the screen will appear in front of you of the window movie maker now let's discuss about the components of the windows movie maker the components of the windows movie maker are shown below you can see many call outs on this picture for example the title bar menu bar tabs quick access toolbar movie maker button groups storyboards preview full screen change thumbnail size zoom slider bar ribbon movie control panel preview monitor pane and etc let's discuss it individually the first one is title bar it is located at the top of the windows movie maker window it displays the project name and the application's title the title bar also has buttons for minimizing maximizing and closing the program menu bar it contains a collection of all the menus such as home animations visual effects project and view these options allow us to access edit and save the movies movie maker button it is located to the extreme left of the menu bar and contains features to create new project open a project save a project import images etc storyboard it is used to arrange and manage the video clips in our project it is also shows the transitions and visual effects that are applied to the clips preview monitor pane on the left hand side of the storyboard is a preview screen you will able to watch your videos here as you work on it the advantage of using this pane is that you can see how the final result will look like and make modification as required before publishing it let us learn and understand more about these components by doing a practical on how we can make a movie in a windows movie maker 
First of all, click on the Start button. In the Start button menu, there is a All Program button. You can see here the Movie Maker option. Click on that. The first window will appear in front of you is the Movie Maker screen. So to create a movie, in a Movie Maker, first of all, you had to add or import some videos, images or audio files to make the movie or the slideshow. So follow these steps. Click on the Add Videos and Photos button present on the Home tab in the Add group. So the Add and Videos Photos dialog box will appear in front of you. Choose Pictures from the Library folder and select the sample pictures that you require. Click on the picture, click on the Open button. The selected picture will appear in front of you in the Storyboard. Select all the images that you require. Like we want this picture to be on the storyboard, select it, open it. Now you will see the second picture on the storyboard. Similarly, you can import videos. From the video button in the library folder, in the sample folder, there is a video, select it, open it and you will see all the images and videos are arranged in the story pane as a film strip. You can also customize the look of your storyboard by selecting the zoom in and zoom out option button on the zoom slide bar at the bottom of the screen. Now click on the play button in the preview monitor pane to preview the movie. So let's start. You will see here the first picture you have imported as film strip is going ahead. Now the second picture will appear in front of you and after that the video we have imported you will see that. The third one is video. From here this button you can play and pause your video and also you can forward it and rewind it. So in this way you can create your own movie or slideshow. Windows Movie Maker supports a variety of audio and video formats such as .mp3 .wma and .asf. To add an audio file, follow these steps. Click on the Add Music button present on the Home tab in the Add group. Click on the button. You will see here are many options. Click on the Add Music and the Add Music dialog box will appear. Import any file from the Sample Music folder in the Music Library. For example, sleepaway.mp3. Click on the Open button. And in the storyboard, you will see that there is a green bar at the bottom of the clips and images which indicates that the audio file has been imported as shown in this. So let's play the button in the preview monitor pane to preview the movie. From here you can also pause and play the movie and review that what you have imported. So this is all about adding your music. You can apply transitions on the images and the videos you have imported. To apply the transitions follow these steps. Click on the Animations tab. The list of transitions is displayed in the Transition group. Click on the More drop down arrow at the bottom right of the list and the list expands into various categories like Dissolves, Reveals, Cinematic, etc. Click on the video or the image on which you want to apply the transition. It will be applied at the beginning of the clip or the image. For example, we will select this transition. If you want to apply the transition on all the clips and the images in your project, click on Apply to All. Play the video and notice the effect. You will see the transition on the image first, and image second, and also on the image third. You can have number of transitions. Like if you want to have the transition on the first slide, you will have number of options like checkboard, 
so apply to all and see the effect so this is how you can apply the transitions on your images So this is all about our today's video where we have discussed about what is Windows Movie Maker, what are its contents and some features like how to add images and videos, how to add audio files and how we can apply the transitions on the images and videos. In the next video we will discuss some more features. So till then take care. Bye bye.